Hi guys, welcome back to the part two where I um, test pets at home like pet products and stuff on my deggies and review them basically. So yeah, this is part two and so if you haven't watched part one, I would recommend you go and watch that one. But yeah, let's just, let's just get right to it. Here, um, if you watched the first part, I have the things that we had to test out on the first, like, kind of group. Uh, so I, I'm grouping them, basically. So the, these are the stuff that we didn't test out last time. And so, yeah, I'm going to do these two and then this one at the end. Uh, but because I know that they love these, these are just, like, normal wood. Um, and they just, yeah, they love to chew them and then go play and then come back and chew them a little bit so yeah they're just normal sticks those I would just put in their cage at the end so um may I remind you guys uh, these have apple inside it they also have other stuff obviously but apple is already quite bad for them so I'm going to give it to them like once a week so one of these probably would last once or yeah once or twice a week yeah, and these ones are probably really good to give in smaller amounts as well. So yeah, and always check if they're for degus right there. Uh, so they're basically for any animal really, if you have any other pets. But um, mainly for... No, really, for any animal, but just not for ferrets, technically. That's all. So yeah, let's just test out this first. I think I'm going to go with this. Um, just to see if they like it first. So, I will open this one first and put it in Lucky's cage. And then Ricky, and he is so excited. Aren't you, Ricky? Okay. But, we're going to give it to Lucky first because he's in the bigger cage. Okay, so I'm going to open this up. Alright, so really easy to open up as usual. Uh, except I kind of ripped it on there so I don't know I might have to put it in like a a pin thing or or I'm just gonna put it in another bag and I'm done with it so this oh it's not open fully okay so now I've fully opened it up and I don't know let me just it smells quite good oh I, I think they'll like it a lot so I don't know how we're going to do this. Should I just... Okay, he hasn't finished his food from today yet. Oh, he can smell it. Wait, I can get like another little pot to put inside it first. I won't scatter it around their cage just yet. So this was the only old pot that I could find. And so I'm going to put just a teeny weeny bit in it. Okay, wait, let me just put, just put a little bit more. I'm just trying not to like... Okay, there we go. I think that's fine. I didn't really spill. But, um... Yeah, I think that's fine. I don't even know... So, these just look like little bits of, like, dried grass. And I don't know what this is. It looks like... Like... I don't know what it is, I don't know if you can see it. It's like a little bit of... It looks like they're sawdust. I actually don't know what it is. Okay, wait. Should we just give this to them and see if they like it or not? Did you like that? Yes? Okay. Let's give this one to Lucky. They actually look like bits of sawdust. Like, let me just get a bit of sawdust right here. Sorry, I'm stealing some of your bedding. Okay. Don't they look the same? Okay, now, now I, I don't have to get confused. So, this one goes back in there. And we give this one to 
Ricky. Did you like it? Yeah, he liked it. Okay, now we're going to try and just put the ball right there. Oh god, yes, he loves it. Look at him getting right in there. You love it, don't you, baby? Come here. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. Okay, so he just loves it a lot. They love those, like, sawdust bits thing. I didn't even know if there's, like, a type of seed or something, but I think they like it all a lot. So, baby, baby, stop, wait. Oh, my God, stop. <laughs> Good boy. Okay, it's your turn. Oh, he seems to like it as well. Not as much as Lucky. You could definitely tell. He's good. It's fine. Oh, they love it so much. He's still going away and eating it. Okay, baby, stop. No, stop. Good boy. I don't actually want them to fall. Do you want some more? Yeah, they definitely love the sawdust bits. But now, I think we're going to get some more of this. Ooh, that was nice. And then, put it like, put some inside their cage. So, let me see how I can do this without him. Ooh, eating everything. So, I'm just going to put it on the bottom layer so all this floor and then the other floors I'm just gonna leave as they are so this floor I'm gonna put it in so if you can see I've kind of put some right there down here and just around the front here and then down a bunch down here and then around the back there uh, I refilled this so I refilled another little bit and um, now I'm gonna I think I'm just going to put a tiny bit more on here, so let me just try to show you. So I'm just going to put a little bit everywhere. I don't want to put a chunk all in one place because he has to like go and forage around and find them basically himself like he would in his normal habitat. Okay, so I'm putting this here and let me just grab a little bit. And let me just put it. So I've put some there, and he hasn't even realised yet. Okay, he's put them now. Okay, clearly they love this, and this is like a real. I think this is like one of the best forage foods I've given them. Uh, there is a lot more foraging foods to give them but this one is so far one of the best so I would really recommend that one and then this one we'll put in the bin pile down there and uh, yeah I'm just gonna finish giving him a bit more around his cage because there's loads of space that that could go in like down there in this little space and then, yeah, he just, oh my god, he's so messy. Like, look at where he's put his toys. Oh, and wait, let me show you guys something. Guys, do you remember this from the first video? Yeah, this one that I didn't really like. It's still there from just where I put it last time. It's still right there. It's like, I've just noticed now because I've put these there. That's not really spread out though. Let me just, there we go. Um, so yeah, it's still there, and uh, maybe tomorrow it's going to be still there, like, again. So, for part three, I'll probably have to do a part three, I'm I was just thinking. Probably for part three, I'm going to 
Uh, I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna update you guys on if they leave it there and if I actually eat it. So, yeah, let me just actually finish giving him the rest of his nice foraging food. Okay, so I finished putting some more on him. So down here, just in there. Um, I put some underneath the wheel. If you can see some just behind there. And yeah, just right there in that little corner. And now the bowl is empty. I kind of gave some more to Lucky around here. But they are still just eating it. They just, yeah. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to interrupt your foraging time. Anyways, so we'll just put the bowl aside just in case we need it for another foraging thing. We're just going to leave that to the side. And now that we've tested this one, um, oh my god, it won't focus. Anyways, now that we've tested this one, uh, we can, one second, so guys don't look inside this, surprise. Uh, I'll get this bigger one I think. I'll see, I'll put one of these on here and then put it inside and then we can test these ones which I'm really excited about. So the smaller one was enough and I actually ripped it all the way down here so I had to put it as low as possible. But yeah, that goes in there. And how about we just take this bag out. Okay, wait, let me just... There we go. Take this fat bag out and then, um, yeah, here's the stuff from last time. And I'm so excited to give these to them next week. Or in the next two weeks, I don't even know. In the next few weeks, I'm so excited to give them those. I don't think I'll be giving them those, really. But I'll tell you... I'll try to get them used to them. And I'll tell you guys how... How it's going, really. So, in here is going to go all the stuff we've done, basically. So, those two are going to go in there soon. Yeah, so, let's just test that one out already. So we're going to take that off, put it in the little bin pile and um, yeah that was really easy to take off. And yeah we're going to test these. Some look like a different colour but they all look pretty normal, like normal twigs but they're not really, I know they're not because I've got loads of different stuff inside so I'm going to open it properly and then We'll give it to Lucky first, as usual. The one in the biggest cage goes first. Guys, this is actually the neatest I've ever opened one of them so far. Cause like, look at that, perfect. Anyways, I'm gonna give them a smaller one. So, um, yeah, so that we have time to test the others. But, yeah, so far he's basically finished everything. Haven't you, baby, haven't you? You loved that, didn't you? Yes? Okay then, yeah, you go back to foraging. Oh, where is he? Oh, there he is. He's gone to another area. He really likes it. Honestly, I really recommend these as well. So, yeah, I'll pick out two really thin and small ones um, to give in their cage. And I'll probably put another really small one inside, just hidden somewhere so they can find it. So, uh, yeah. So it wasn't actually that hard to find two of the same length. Um... But they look kind of a different colour. I don't know if it shows on camera. But this one that just fell looks a bit darker. Like in real life. And more like they just look different, okay? So let's just put that to the side and let's test it on. Okay, so I knew they would like it. It's got apple inside. I've never actually given them a piece of apple because you're not actually supposed to give them fruits. Um, yeah, sorry, just keep going. Oh no, baby, you don't like it? Let me just, oh. Do you not like it? So he takes it off me, like, thinking that he likes it. But he doesn't actually... Okay, so that's going to be left right there. I think he does like it. I don't know, maybe he's full. I don't know. Let's just see if um, 
Ricky has the same reaction. Oh, so he was a bit unsure about this one. Where are you going to take it? Okay, he does not know what to do with it. Alright, you guys go in the most unusual of places. Okay, so he's hiding it. Did you go hide it? So, I don't know, I think, what is that? Oh, the bit from earlier. The little, oh, hello. Okay, so he went to hide it. So, they do kind of, I mean, they don't show much appreciation for these foods and lovely foraging stuff, apart from the last one we tried, but, okay, so. He's going on his wheel, so he just, yeah, yeah, you know, he's minding his own business as well. Okay, let's just try the last one. These, I don't even know if this was, like, a success or a failure. Like, did they like it? I mean, I don't know, because they barely even... It's basically, I would just get normal wood, guys, like this, instead of that, because, I mean, I don't know how much this costs, uh, but I think that one, this one is much cheaper than that one, because that's got lizards and stuff inside, and this is just wood. So, I would just spend my money on this one instead of that, but maybe my diggers just don't like the taste of apple or something, I don't even know. So, all deckies are different, it's worth a try, but I'm just showing you guys the things that are, like, really good, like, that your deckies are most probably to like, basically. Are you ready to try the next one? Okay, then this one's just normal wood, so, okay, so let me just unravel that. Okay, so I just slid that piece of wood right across, you don't actually have to, like, um take all these off um, it's better to just keep everything on because I don't know just it makes storing it easier oh our foraging testing bowl is still there <sighs> okay so let's give one to Lucky no I didn't put anything in there do you like it? yeah I know it's just normal wood Okay, he's giving it a second thought. No? Okay, well we're gonna leave it in there and um, you know, the next time I film a video I'm going to keep you updated on that as well. So he's just gonna mind his own business. Let's get one out for um, Ricky, so let's get like no, not that one. That one's so thin. Okay, let's just see from the top. I think... I think... Wait, how thick was that one? This was, like... A little thick. I don't even know how to compare it. One second. Let me compare it and let me get one. I think, like... I wouldn't even know. Maybe this one? Okay, wait. Sorry, Lucky. Okay. Check that one out. It looks a bit thicker. Actually, no, they look about the same size. You know, I want to give them, like, a fair thing. So where do I put it now? There you go. It's down here. I don't have it. Okay, so I'm just gonna get the other stuff ready and I'll tell you guys if he goes there. Come on, buddy, good boy. Oh, oh, oh. No, it's down here. 
Can you see it? No, the other way. Turn your head. Turn your head the other way. Ugh, what are you doing? I don't have anything. Come on, right here. Okay, so he likes chewing wood more than Lucky does, but he doesn't seem interested at all about this one. Okay, so... Oh, by the way, guys, they have been really, really sleepy. Like, throughout the whole morning, I wanted to film the video because I was actually really excited for part two. But they have just been so, so sleepy, and they've slept through the whole morning. Are you having your bath dust? I should just tell you having your bath. Anyways, I think we've actually, I think my mum got me bath dust for them as well in the bag oh well we will check and we will put these away but these are recommended because um they've loved them other times i just think i don't know they haven't been chewing that much these days i don't think maybe they don't really need it because they've destroyed two houses already that's why i don't really get them houses anymore that's why i don't really get them anything really like no I'm just joking I do like to get them hammocks like this but they did destroy this one as well it's so hard to film by the way there we go look at that they did destroy that one and then um if you haven't already noticed they destroyed this one so we need to get new hammocks for you guys and uh yeah so I haven't really heard them to for now but yeah, I guess I really recommend these, but I would recommend these ones if um, your dad who doesn't really like, has to like wear out their teeth, but doesn't because they don't like the wood. Maybe these ones would be good for your degus, I don't know. I don't know why my degus didn't like them, I was really like, really disappointed. I was, I was really hoping that they liked it, I expected they did. But, no. So, let's just get our other stuff out from the beautiful bag. Okay, so I'm going to place these back in here. And that one there. I'm going to organise things better when everything's inside. But for now, uh, um, let's just... Okay, so let's just peek into a bag. And I don't know, I think like still food... Or toys, what do you think guys? I think I'll do like a separate one on toys because there are a few toys that you can see in here. Let me just dug them to the bottom so you can't see them. It's all a surprise guys, well it's supposed to be a surprise. Okay, let's just take out these little ones, look interesting. So I've got, ooh, more foraging! Yes, I love foraging! Okay. Okay, these look exciting. So this is kind of like... I'm starting the, um, what's it called, the for, no, 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 that's a, these are foraging, but I'm starting the second round kind of thing of these little ones. So, we've got on our first one, oh my god, they look so, they look like, they all look like something they would like, I think they would like these ones the most. Because um, sometimes I get flowers from my garden, and these one looks like these look like something they would like. Oh, so wait, I I have never had these before, never seen them before. Oh well, I saw these ones when I went to Petzl Home the last time, but these ones I have actually had before. And um, to be honest, they just love the petals. The rest inside, which is just like normal hay, I think. Um, they just don't eat it, they just leave it there. But they love the petals, so I would really recommend these. And then, yeah, so this one is, so it contains red, red cornflower and sunflower petals. Okay. This is, this is very particular. It is for degus, as you can see. Um... This one contains blue cornflower and caramel, okay. 
And then this one just has Timothy Hay. Okay, Hay, yeah, normal Hay, I think that is. And Rose Petals, which they love. And here it even tells you, like, this encourages natural behaviour. So it does it for all of them, if you can see. And then, um, perfect as a food topper. Oh, yeah, so I actually used this. Um, I used to use this as, like, um, when they had their food, I used to, like, kind of put a little bit in it just to, like, encourage them to eat their food because they do leave some of their food. And, like, I, when they started, there was this period when they started leaving their food there. And, and so I started putting, like, like, I started putting less of it. But that wasn't good for them because they were getting quite skinny and I didn't know why they weren't eating their food. So I started putting these toppers on top and they actually started eating them a bit more. Or, yeah. So, yeah, I don't even know which one we're going to start with. I think this one because I already know and then leave the best till last. I think we're going to leave, yeah, this one till last because it looks quite good. I mean, they both look good, but I don't know. I, would just, I think this one, I've got high hopes for this one. Okay, so let's start with the first one, the Timothy Hay and Rose Petals. Guys, it smells like roses. Like, this is amazing. I, I've, I've started smelling their stuff more often and because it, it just smells really good to me. And this smells like roses, like a strong smell of roses. I just, I love it. And this is, by the way, a petal forage mix. Yeah, with Timothy Hay and Rose Petals. So, that's basically what it says here. Anyways, um, I'm going to put it in as a forage, like, not as a... I'm not going to put it in with their food. I'm just going to put it in as I did with these. I don't even remember what it's called. Are you ready? Can you smell it? Can you smell it? Okay, so, that is actually a little, he found something in there, wait, that's a little bud from a little flower. Okay, I did not see that in there, so there must be like little flower buds, like dried flower buds in there. So anyways, let me just put some in here so I show you the full thing. Okay, so this is actually pretty small and I don't want to waste it so we're gonna only put this much so we, they're gonna share this between them and I'm not gonna put them necessarily every day but after like um, I don't know three days I'm gonna put about that much for each of them so I'll just put that right there and I'll put some I'll sprinkle some around and it already looks really nice like the colors just are so gorgeous oh wait I need to split it between them so I'm gonna take a little bit more I think and I'm gonna sprinkle it there and then the rest is for Ricky okay okay darling one second Okay, let me just pick some up so I don't drop any. And then I'll sprinkle it here, I guess. There you go. Yeah, they love they love it. Don't show your butt. Sometimes it's so hard to film them. Okay, let me just get Okay, while he's eating, we'll put it in his <laughs> right there. Okay, let's just sprinkle it around. Even in there. Oi, what's he doing? I'm trying to sprinkle it around. Get off. No! Okay, I think some jumped inside. Okay, he's going to take care of that. I can't get it in. Okay, I spilled them. Okay, let me just get a little bit more. Because I don't feel, I feel like I've given loads to... You know what? I'm not going to do that. One sec, let me give this to her. Okay. You, we don't care about you anymore. We're going to just pour it in like this. Hopefully that it doesn't come down too much. 
Okay, so it looks pretty nice. Don't know if I can... Ooh. Okay, that's a lot. Okay, so that one, I don't know how I'm going to seal it, but after I'm going to seal that one, but let's just get on to this one first. So this one, just to remind you, is the red cornflower and some flower petals. They look nice. And they're all dried. They look all dried. So, yeah, let me just open this. Okay, this one smells even better. Oh, it smells so good. Guys, I'm sorry for the background noise. But, um, yeah, this is the only time I could film it today. Oh, that smells really good. Uh, I think I'm just going to, like, sprinkle it on. So it's got, like, flower petals and little buds inside. Wait, does he like them? Oh, he's a savage. Okay, so I've put quite a bit. There seems to be more in this one. Because like, I haven't, I've barely used this. And it, it, I haven't even given them that much. But it's all, it's just everywhere. And he's just going to go around eating it. Okay, yeah, he likes them. He likes the petals, I think. But, one second. Let me just let him taste one of these buds. Okay, so the buds.